Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling an intriguing question from one of our viewers about storing vertices as JSON in Cosmos DB. They ask, all the examples I've seen using the Gremlin API to query a Cosmos DB graph use vertices that have one level of properties. But what if we want to represent our vertices as JSON documents? This is a great question that touches on the complexities of data modeling in graph databases. All right, guys, we're back with another technical question. I'll be going through the question, the answer, and I'm hoping, just like me, you stay a little bit crazy to get that answer all the way through. Guys, let's get started. When storing a vertex as JSON in Cosmos DB using the Gremlin API, we need to consider how to handle nested properties effectively. In many cases, it may be unnecessary to split nested properties into separate vertices. Instead, we can store them directly within the vertex as JSON. However, if you decide to flatten the structure for performance reasons, you could implement an adapter class. This class would handle the conversion between the nested JSON and a flat structure. Keep in mind that while flattening can improve performance, it may add complexity to your code. Always weigh the trade-offs based on your application's needs. In conclusion, choose the approach that best fits your use case. For simple applications, storing nested properties directly may suffice. For larger applications, consider using an adapter. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. You can store a vertex as JSON in Cosmos DB using the Gremlin API. While Cosmos DB supports nested properties, the schema requirements differ from standard JSON formats. Gremlin allows multiple values per key and meta properties for each value. For example, you can add a vertex property and then add a nested property to it. Here's an example of how the JSON document would look in Cosmos DB with the vertex property schema, including nested properties for name and address. And that's it, I hope that helped find the resolution that you're looking for. If it did, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.